this is pretty much the view as it looks from looking out from my house just you know from a general perspective it's hard to uh, simulate exactly what it looks like looking out your back window but this is pretty much what I see the red rectangle is the flagpole okay I'm just gonna zoom back out here now we're gonna take a look through the monoculars so this is a quick look through the binoculars at what they call 25 power okay uh, it's just it's it's not in the best of focus but that's what it is okay so now we're into full power zoom okay this is the Vermont flag flapping around over here <coughs> it could probably be a little better focus but it's got pretty good focus for uh, my first experimental video shooting okay I'm gonna show you something else here's pretty much what you would see looking out my window there's a windmill way off in the background and here you're gonna see the windmill at the lowest power setting of the binoculars okay it's uh you should be able to see it pretty clearly and here we have the windmill at full power so as you can see the difference between what's called 25 power and what's called 125 power I question how high that power is to a certain degree you know what I mean to me four times the power should be four times larger well here I am at a lower power okay I'm just kinda of panning up and looking at the mountains these mountains are way off in the distance the area I'm looking at is this little chunk of mountain over here now you can see that's quite a ways off in the distance okay I mean <laughs> it seems like the further you look out the stronger these binoculars uh, bring stuff in so that's what I mean by I don't quite understand the power settings that's highest power so I mean this is this is Dick's Mountain it's called it's 30 miles away okay obviously it's still a little bit of a distance looking away but this is how tiny of an area I'm actually focused in on I mean 30 miles away so <laughs> I'm just learning how to put a tripod properly in front of these binoculars so I've got a camera in front of the binoculars. I'll have better footage coming and I'll be putting my tutorial together soon. That's it for now.